Hello cellist, this is your previews video for Bore. This is the last piece in Suzuki Book 2. Um, congratulations. We're going to start at measure 17. This is the second line of the second page. So I want you to make a bracket around that line. It just starts measure 17 um, till the end of the line right before measure 21. Um, and do it a few times, do that bracket a few times, but I also want you to just spend time getting used to extended second position with fingers on multiple strings. So we're gonna try the shift. This is second finger where fourth finger goes, or second position. Um, and then first finger reaches all the way back for a whole step reach. Most students have a hard time getting that reach far enough back. Check open C with middle C. When you do it, try to keep second finger down. And now the real trick is getting this fourth finger high enough. You can actually check the fourth finger E with a harmonic E. You just have to make sure nothing else is touching. So you can check all three of these notes. And just Take some time each day, maybe a minute to two minutes, making sure your hand is stretched out far enough. What I don't want to see is this. Right? We want your hand to be able to keep all the fingers down so that we can go back and forth in that hand frame, that's what we call it. So try to keep your fingers stretched out two minutes a day of this. If you if you want, you can play taps. If you change the order, you can do NBC. <laughs> There's lots of songs you can make up with those three notes, but the important thing is that you get used to having your hand open enough to play them without picking up your fingers. Okay, there's a tricky run just on the next line. Um, this is measure 22, 23. I'm just gonna start right on it. Open A. Shift. Again, you can check that shift with your open string. With a shift and the slur separate, it, it often throws students for a loop. Make sure that you're doing slur separate, slur separate, slur separate, up, up. Um, so between the bowing and the shift there, there's some tricky things. I would say just do that one on a loop. So 20 times a day. One. Ah. Don't count it unless it's a good repetition. Up, up. All right. I think Bore is actually easier than Gavotte that we just learned. It sort of is a celebration of all the things that we've been working on in Suzuki Book 2. I just have those two previews for you, okay? Extended second position and then that tricky run. Happy practicing, Chalice.